Welcome at forexcstrading.com. What is the trend? Here we got Euro dollar chart. Let's go weekly first. As you see right now on the chart, we have some some big moves where the uh, each candle in this chart, weekly chart, is one week. So we got move like here, the downtrend. We have also the uptrend, just right here, the big move during many weeks. And we have again downtrend and the longer time of market growing it is the uptrend. So currently we are looking at week chart and we see the trend is growing. Growing because of those candles here in some longer time. That's what trend is. Some move in some direction in particular time. So this candle right here, it doesn't really showing the uh price section doesn't really showing the trend has changed because it is just one candle so if we were trading in and each candle would showing us what kind of trend do we have we could go crazy with those positions and most of the time we have to stick to the trend unless some important signals will come up to change the position at a different trend most of the instruments you will have to go with the trend to make some pips to make it worth the profit from the market most of them like currencies like commodities like different instruments on different platforms that's why we go we gonna talk about trends so much but it's not so easy and it's not so really simple as it looked like I'm gonna show you for different charts for bigger time frame to smaller in this direction uh, because in my opinion it is important to look at the bigger time frame at the beginning and to go through all the smaller time frames if we are looking to enter the market in particular moment that's what I'm gonna show you in the future how to use trends how to use different time charts with with different positions and different strategies it might be confusing at the beginning but it is, as you can see at those move here sometimes most of the time the trend is going one direction and it's really simple to see the trend after some time sometimes it is a short time sometimes it takes a while to see what the trend is after the change of trend like it happened here with letter of v. this is kind of pattern so right now we are gonna go to day chart as you can see the one thing I mentioned uh, we have three kind of trends there is a big trend there is a medium trend and there is a small trend so right now on this chart we can say the big trend is really um, going down this is the move right here the biggest move on the chart and the medium term trend is going up so we have the medium up trend which might become a big uptrend in the future if it's gonna continue to grow but right now we have the situation right here when we are going down and this is the uh, smallest part of the trend so we can say the small trend is going down because of this move and because of this move so it depends really how we see the trend how we name the uh, obvious things on the chart please take a look on different chart as well right now we are looking at 4 hour chart so on this chart the big trend is growing this is the move right here the medium trend is going down this is the downtrend the, this part right here this part right here and the uh, small trend the most current trend is ranging really so we are talking about this move and this move right here if it's ranging or if someone really wish to call this small trend growing because the price is growing right here at the same exact time we can call it the small trend is an uptrend right now but this is this is the less important because the small trend can change in any time so we are not really looking at this um, when we are entering the market let's say right now we want to watch 30 minute chart we gonna we gonna say on this chart the uh, big trend is going down this is a downtrend the medium trend is is in a range this is the part right here 
at the uh, middle of the screen and the small trend the small trend right now it is going down a little bit but the small trend this part right here I'm gonna mark it for a while, while for a second this part right here is growing but right now the price section is showing it is going down so we can call it whenever uptrend or downtrend whatever you wish but the thing is when I'm doing daily analysis I'm watching first thing which is the last biggest kind of move on daily chart this is this is this part of the chart and I'm calling it the uh, uh, the trend uh, the big trend is growing that's what I'm usually doing because I'm going through different charts and I have to really um, make make sure the name of the big trend is known and the medium trend and the small trend so when I'm showing this some daily analysis when I think when I'm thinking when I'm naming the uh, trend the big trend and uptrend I mean this part of the move the biggest part on daily chart recently showed as a trend that's a big trend of course there is a medium part which will be shown more likely at this spot it will be the medium term trend medium term trend uh, is going down so it's a downtrend and the small trend let's say on 30 minute charts it's really really ranging if we, if we uh, take this part right here to to call it generally I wasn't I wouldn't be sure what trend is so I say it's a range let's take a look at different charts let's say for example we're gonna take a look at the gold chart right now we are already looking at the uh, gold daily chart daily is the biggest time frame I'm usually looking at and we see here the big trend the part right here is growing and the recent biggest part of daily candle candles is growing as well so we can call the uh, the big trend is growing here as we look through for our chart it is really simple to say that the big trend and the medium term trend is also growing so when we are looking at the 30 minute charts chart we are saying that the uh, big trend is growing and the medium term trend and the small trend is uh, growing so let's look at this one more time to make it really simple we see the last the biggest part of the uh, gold daily chart is growing so the big trend is called the uh, uptrend right now we're going to look at the trend on the 4 hour chart it is growing as well we can call this last part the less biggest part uh, the medium trend and it is growing so the medium trend is growing as well and we can go through 30 minute chart and right now we can look at this part of 30 minute chart or this part right here to say it is growing if we calling it it through this per perspective or it is ranging with continuation pattern right here that's what we can call it this continuation here so we can really say it is growing as well so we have like three uh, trends which are all growing so that's what we are looking at the uh, forex market to make it really simple that we really know what the trend is and we can keep it so simple to to make the transactions and profit in future I hope the uh, trend definition will be more simple in the future when I'm gonna show you how to use those trends on different time charts on different strategies with different instruments so you can gain more knowledge and practice thank you very much for watching you have a good day